Okay, I want to show you a, one more thing in uh, the custom-made's Airtable. I thought it was pretty cool. I was able to uh, figure out the lifetime value of each client. And for this, I took completed visits, the number of completed visits total, times the value uh, per completed job. So right here, value per... Com per completed job and then completed visits. Yes, that should. Okay. I just want to show you how I got there. So it, make, it makes more sense for you. That should be 3036. Oh, I added <laughs> three times 92. Okay. So this client pays us $92 every time we go finish or go clean their their house. And we've done that 33 times. So that client has been worth $3,000. I see all of the active clients we have here, 469 records. Um, and yeah, they, they don't have any job cancellation date in here. So they are active as of this month or as of July, 2020. 2022. Um, so for this one, the average LTV of all these 469 records is uh, $2,000. Uh, but you can see like there's this one has zero. Um, that's it, there's there's some things in here kind of messing with this. I'm not sure why uh, the value per completed job is, is empty, but it's it's still pretty close. I, my point is that this is a conservative number. Um, so this takes all of all of our, like I said, active. Um, ooh, let me see if I can do this. Yeah. Oh, perfect. Active with seven visits. This is what I came across yesterday. $3,700 is the value of the clients that stay with us seven, that go seven visits or longer. The ones that canceled with us only ever amounted to an average of $840. Um, again, there's a lot of zeros in here as well, but you can see like it, it's never, this one was a big one. These ones are, these ones are pretty big. So I would love to know why those ones canceled or whatever. And a lot of the times it's people going south for the winters. So they're not canceled. They're just suspended. Um, but again, I go back to like, if we can get past that seven visit mark, the average per uh, client that we make goes way up. So we, on average, make thirty-seven hundred dollars um, per client. So I, I, I'm, I'm willing to spend like you know five hundred dollars to find a new client. You know, a thousand dollars. I would say it's more like four or five hundred dollars to find a new client. I'm willing to pay that um, because I know we are increasing our prices. Um, I would not really give advice, that advice, but uh, just for, <laughs> let me see if I can find it. If our average LTV lifetime value, I don't know if you, let's just see what the actual definition is so you don't get clouded by my opinion. It's the total worth to a business of, okay, that makes that sense. Um, it's just to give you an idea of how much you can spend on your marketing you got to find out what your customer lifetime value is. I just put LTV, but it's right here. It's CLV. Um, okay. LTV. And then let's look at here. No, it's. It's in a whole new, um, a whole new Google Chrome profile and the Loom video is recording here on this tab. So I'm not going to be able to take it over. But my point is the, the client LTV is $3,700 and it costs us less than $60 to acquire a client. Though I would be willing to spend up to like a third of that amount, but that's more like for software in info products, I guess. This is home service and a lot of the profit is chewed up by labor. So like, that's not, all that's not profit. Like we have a lot of, uh, a lot of people on our payroll. So most of it needs to go to them anyway. I mean, without 
without those people, the business doesn't exist. So it's like not even, I'm not griping about it. Um, but it is, it's very important to see what your LTV is and see like how you can uh, pump that up so that you know that the company is getting healthier. Uh, so I thought this was cool. Uh, this is a little environment I made um, just to get better visibility. I, I, I put uh, our team in here as well, just to see what our average hourly rate wage is. It is really low right now. And um, it was it was painfully low when we acquired this company and we've been um, steadily increasing wages over the past two years. Uh, it's just, I didn't realize how difficult it was to do that um, quickly. Um, so just some things that, that we learn in the business world, but thought, I, I hope you found this useful. Um, fascinating at least, I did. Anyway, toodles.